Okay, so today I'm reviewing the Timmy and Leslie Classic Tote Diaper Bag. Um, I was really excited to get to choose one of their bags to review. Uh, what I was going for was one that was a good size uh, to be a diaper bag and also pass for a purse. So I did a lot of research on all of their bags, looking at the dimensions and everything, and I chose the Classic Tote in Soho Black. Uh, comes in two other colors. One is like a sandy gray and the other is like an olive green. Um, I chose the black because I think it's just a timeless look. This will match everything I ever wear um, from now until forever. So this bag will be with me until it falls apart and is literally unusable anymore because it is just so cute and it will go beyond baby years. So when you invest in one of these bags, any of their bags really, I feel like you're not just getting a diaper bag, you're getting something that could pass for a really nice bag in the future. So that's an, a great added bonus is that you get a lot of use out of it. Um, this particular one is made out of a very smooth nylon. Um, that was something that I had a hard time choosing between was if I wanted a bag that was all um, their vegan faux leather or if I wanted one that was nylon simply because of one, durability, and two, I really like the slouchiness of the faux leather because I feel like you get that pursed look to it when you get that like really sophisticated, chic looking slouchy bag. So in the end, I ended up choosing this one um, because it still is kind of slouchy. Like if you don't have a lot of stuff in it, it can get slouchy. And also because of um, the size. This particular bag is 16 inches across, 14 inches tall, and five and a half inches wide. Um, so it's like just bordering purse size. Like it's, it's a, it would be a big purse. <laughs> it would be a big purse for sure. But it's, it's doable, so that's why I chose this one. Now, when the baby stuff is in it, it definitely gets stiffer and stands more firm, so it looks a little less purse-like, but if I just have very little in there and it was more like my stuff and just a little bit of baby stuff, you still get that slouchiness to it. So it definitely can pass as a purse. Um, not only do I like it, but my husband likes it as well. And he was actually one of the deciding factors in which bag I reviewed because he just loved this one. And he actually, without me saying it, said that this could go beyond just using it for a baby, that we could use this particular bag for the future, that he would use it, that he thinks it looks manly enough. And he's not like a man's man, like, oh, I won't, I won't carry anything that's pink. Like he'll carry my purse when I'm shopping. He has no problem with that. But he was actually excited that this one looked like a nice bag. Like it almost even looks like a computer bag as far as what he would use it for. So that's a bonus too that the husband likes it. Um, okay, so let's get to the specifications of this baby. It has four outer pockets. It has one in the front. It has a magnetic closure. There's just like a little disc in there. And then there's two side pockets that are insulated for your bottles or sippy cups. And then there's one on the outer back that is a zippered pocket. And that pocket is perfect for the diaper changing pad that comes with it because then you like have quick accessibility to it and it's just right there. I mean, of course you could put it on the inner part of the bag, but it's really nice in that outer bag. So the diaper changing pad has a section on the outside for your diapers, wipes, and creams. And then you open it up and you've got your little changing pad, extra little padded section up there for baby's head. And you just close it up. So that's really nice to have. Um, that is the only like extra, extra accessory that comes with this particular bag. Some of their other bags have like a little clutch for mom. It's almost like a little wallet, I think, and a bottle insulator tote thingy. So this one doesn't come with either of those. This just comes with the changing pad. Now, the other thing that I believe almost all their bags come with are these little um, stroller clips. They have Velcro, so they Velcro onto your stroller, 
And then on the inside, they have this non-slip rubbery stuff. So when you put it on your stroller, it's not going to be sliding around. Like you put it where you want it and it'll stay there. So that's nice to not have it slipping around. And the other thing that comes with it is a cross body strap. So both of those things clip on to these outer brass rings, um, which by the way, that's what the bag has. Those are all antique brass accents all over there. So straps match and everything. Um, one thing about this, it has a neoprene lined pad there. So it's nice and padded for your shoulder, very comfortable. Then the strap itself, like I wish I knew how to describe this to you. It is unlike any bag strap I've ever felt. Like usually they're made out of this nylon that's like cheap feeling. And this is like heavy duty. I wouldn't say plasticky. It's shiny. It's slippery. It's like thick, but yet thin. It's strong. I don't know what it is, but I really like it. And I remember that was like the first thing I noticed when I took the strap out of the packaging. I was like wow, what is this material? So it's really different. It feels like it would be really durable, wouldn't tear, wouldn't, um, wouldn't fray at all. Like it's really strong. I'm, I'm actually really impressed with that strap. So I don't know what it is, but I like it. And it's the same material that's right here on this strap on the bag. Um, I feel like this bag would be extremely durable. I actually got stuck out in the rain with it the other day. And I was surprised at its water repelling capabilities. Like I wasn't in like a torrential downpour, but it was enough that normally the bag would have been pretty wet by the time I got inside. And it like, it didn't take on water. It was just like rolling off of the nylon and I just wiped it down and it was fine. So that was a surprise added bonus to see that um, it did good in the rain. So... I'm really happy with this bag. Um, oh, I didn't do the inside pockets. The inside looks like this. It has a zippered pocket up here on the back wall. Let's close that. And then it has two cinched pockets there, two cinched pockets below that, and two more on the outer edges there and then you have just your innermost section um at first I was concerned that it just had one large section on the inside because usually I like to get diaper bags that have a um middle separator so that you have two large sections with a divider in the middle because then your stuff isn't all floating around together but most bags don't have all of those little separated sections on the outer edge so I'm fine. Like I don't need that divider in the middle. I feel like there's plenty of um, organizational spaces on this bag on the inside and the outside that um, there's not so many that you forget where you put stuff, but there's not so few that you feel cluttered. So I actually think that the amount is perfect and you really don't have to worry about the fact that it doesn't have that divider um, on the innermost section. So I've been very happy with it. I can find what I'm looking for when I need it. It doesn't get cluttered. It doesn't get bombarded with all the stuff. So I've been very happy with um, that aspect of it. Oh, one other thing that it has that I almost forgot. On the inside, you have this little clip for your keys. Now, I have like a carabine clip on my keys because I'm always clipping it on my belt loop or I usually clip it on one of these outer rings on all of my bags or my purse. But if you don't have one of those clips, then you usually end up just throwing them in your bag. So for those of you that don't have one of those clips on your keys, this is perfect because it opens and you just clip it right on your key ring. It's right there and you don't have to search through your diaper bag for your keys. So that's nice that it has that. Um, yeah, so I guess that's it. I am super happy with this bag. I'm so happy with the sophisticated look that it gives like look at this thing I love it I don't think at first look most people would think oh hey that's a diaper bag so 
I'm really happy. I really think it served the purpose that I was looking for. A diaper bag that can pass as a big purse. So yeah, I like it. I love it. I'm really happy with it and I think you would be too. If you have any comments or questions, please comment below. If you have any requests, please comment below. Uh, thanks for watching. Please subscribe and I will see you next time.